Good evening. Thanks for being with us. Millions of dollars for downtown projects and a facelift for other parts of the city. It's all part of the mayor's 2011 capital budget. But critics argue that the mayor is ignoring basic services. Margot Spann joins us now with details of some of the key points of the plan. Margot. Hi, Susan and Eric. The mayor says the budget does address basic services and two other key areas, neighborhoods and economic development. The money in the 2011 budget is about thinking strategically. Mayor Dave Cheslevich announced his plans to upgrade equipment at local parks and to invest $100,000 researching neighborhood centers. And so the idea is to make some money available in 2012, but to spend 2011 making sure that we make those investments strategically where they're needed most. Critics say spending money on research in community centers is unnecessary. We all know what the needs are of the Meadowood Neighborhood Association. We know what's going on in other neighborhoods in the city of Madison. This is no surprise to anyone that this city needs to invest in neighborhoods. The mayor says it was also important to improve fire and police services. Next year's budget includes a new fire engine and renovating fire station number two. He says this will keep response times down. The budget also calls for building a new police training facility. It was important for us to have our own facility. So for the first time ever, the city of Madison will have its own dedicated facility for training police officers. A large piece of the budget will go towards funding a public market near the future high-speed rail. He says that's the wrong direction to go with our tax dollars. This administration continues to avoid or ignore the basic city services and instead are, are spending money in luxury items. The mayor says his 2011 budget is about making smart investments in the city's infrastructure, so when the economy recovers, we'll be able to take advantage of that. So then what happens next, Margo, in his budget plan? Well, the mayor is actually going to formally present his uh, plan tonight to the Common Council. They're expected to review it and make amendments before voting on it in November. We will continue to follow it. Margo Spann reporting tonight. Thanks, Margo.